The fossil record depicts how a number of groups of reptiles adapted to marine life. Their adaptations included modifying their limbs to form paddles and modifying their body shape, in the ichthyosaurs becoming rather dolphin-like, in the plesiosaurs developing very long necks, which could have more than 70 vertebrae. We know that some of these even evolved live birth, so they would not have to come on land to reproduce. Not only have many turtles adapted their bodies to be adept at swimming in freshwater environments, sea turtles have become adept at swimming in the ocean. The modifications of the limbs are not as extensive as what is observed in some of those extinct fossil forms. Turtles and sea turtles possess the same basic bones of their limbs. So, for example, the arm, uh, whether it be a basal reptile, a semi-aquatic turtle, or a sea turtle, possesses a humerus, a radius, and an ulna, carpal bones or wrist bones, metacarpals attached to them, and phalanges. In the same way, the leg would be composed of a femur, a tibia, and fibula, uh, tarsal bones, and metatarsals and phalanges. Uh, in sea turtles, we simply uh, observe that these digits have been lengthened and connective tissue helps to fuse the digits together uh, to make a single paddle. Connective tissue also fuses the radius and the ulna together. Other adaptations in sea turtles for marine life include uh, the fact that the neck is short and non-retractable. The limbs are non-retractable. The carapace is smaller and thus uh, more streamlined, and the uh, carapace, that's the upper portion of the shell, is not fused to the plastron, the lower uh, portion of the shell, so that the shell can be compressed a bit while diving. The nostrils close underwater. There are salt glands near the eyes which excrete salt. The lungs have uh, increased surface area and improved gas exchange. In the blood, higher amounts of hemoglobin and higher amounts of red blood cells help store oxygen for deeper dives. Uh, the swimming muscles are enlarged, as are their muscle attachments. So, for example, the coracoid region of the shoulder girdle is enlarged uh, for uh, the attachment of swimming muscles. And thus, sea turtles have diverse adaptations uh, for marine life and their form of locomotion in the ocean.